very much. It's so nice to see such a big crowd here. It's phenomenal. What was the name of that one? That was a tune by saxophonist John Coltrane called Equinox. It's blues in our favorite key of D flat minor. All right. <laughs> uh, My favorite key. Featuring Drew Serafini on the guitar. Yeah. And Brian Miller on the bass. We're very excited to be here. Uh, I was here last year simply as a spectator and left thinking, you know, what a great event, but man, they need more saxophone. <laughs> so, so here we are. Um, it, it's, it's great to be here. That was Equinox by John Coltrane. We're going to continue with another tune that John Coltrane recorded but didn't write. Um, this is a tune that was originally written in 1921. Um, covered by Coltrane, Django Reinhardt, all sorts of musicians over the years. Um, hope you enjoy our take on Limehouse Blues.
Put a turn up. <laughs> Drew's turning up. Uh, this next song is called Bird Song by Trump player Nat Hatter. I Yeah, that's actually a little known fact. And then you're going to go with Thank you. 
excited to be here. Once again, Drew Serafini on the guitar, Brian Miller on the drums. My name is Jacob Perry. I'm on the bass. Drummer? <laughs> we have one more, one more tune for you tonight. Um, this is the most modern tune in the set. Uh, it's, it's a tune called Ryland. It's by a current guitarist by the name of Julian Lodge. If there are any Julian Lodge fans in the house, it's, it's fantastic. You should all check him out. Uh, and this is kind of one of his more laid back sort of global vibes. So this is like it's pretty funny. Hope you enjoy. Jacob, not gonna lie, this is really the most artistic piece of music I've ever seen. It's like how it looks. It's very good. Especially that
Thanks, man. Thank you, guys. And thank you, Penner, for you, everybody.